Would you tell Mr. Chambers I'm here? Is he expecting you, Miss Todd? When does he ever expect me? Mr. Chambers is busy with people all day long. You really should call and let people know when you're coming. And you should keep your face out of private family business. Mr. Chambers? Cyrus, I beg you to reconsider. You haven't signed anything yet. It's not too late to back out. Mr. Chambers, Faith Todd is on her way in. Tom, could you give us uh, two minutes? Sure. Be in my office. Come on in. If you have come in here to blackmail me some more, you can just forget it. What you talking about? Blackmail? I'm your daughter asking her father for money. No judge or jury is going to call that blackmail. I promised your mama I'd remember you in my will, and I intend to. Well, I don't intend to sit around here and wait for you to die. I want my money now. You mean your inheritance? I don't know, but I want 250000 Oh, come on, don't be silly. Well, I got me a lawyer thinks it isn't a bit silly. He thinks that's how much we should get, Mom and me. He's ready to take you to court. Court? What's he going to sue me for? I don't know. I'll leave that up to him. But he says we can do it. Why do you need so much? I want to leave and get married and maybe even go to school. And I, I need some cash right away. I can get you the usual. But the rest is going to take some time. Let's get together tomorrow night, down at the mill. <sighs> the mill. Your mama said y'all used to meet there. Said that's where you and she started me. I got things to do. I can be there 1130, not sooner, not later. Definitely selling the business. Cyrus, why? I'm tired and I want out. I'm taking Irene and we are going to travel around the world. What about me? The partnership? You brought me down here 13 years ago with the assurance that I, I was. Never blended in. You should have stayed in Chicago. It was a promise. There was no promise. Besides, do you think I'd let somebody that threatened me be a partner? Come on, Cyrus. Come on, we were having an argument. All right. I was a little out of line. Way out of line, and I remember what we were arguing about. It was Irene, the way you're always watching her. You said you'd like to kill me. Well, I didn't mean anything by that, Cyrus. It didn't worry me. You don't scare me. The point is, anyone dumb enough to say something like that, I'd hardly have as a partner. 